So hello everyone, welcome back to another video and today I'm here with my dad and we are doing experiments using Smartivity's amazing science lab and the link for this will be in the description and let's start with this video. So in our first experiment we will use this lab one which is showing the reaction between acids, bases and some fizzy reactions. We will do the experiment number one and two today. Yeah. And so let's start what is the experiment number one. We all know that lemons contains acids. Yeah. And acidic substances they taste sour. That's now true. the question is how do we know if a substance is acidic without tasting it? So that there is an experiment for that. So we are doing this experiment. For this experiment, we will need sub substances. And, and can you tell me what are the substances we need for this? We need some butterfly pea powder and citric acid. So there is a butterfly pea powder given in this pouch. We, and have, we have filled it in this. Kept in this small cup. And, and we, we need citric acid. We need citric acid which is given in this. We can also put it in this cup. Yes. And we also need baking soda for this experiment. And we have kept baking, baking soda. Baking soda is for the experiment number two. two. Yes, that will come in experiment number two. But for the sake of experiment number one, let's start it. Yes. And what is the first step? So, add and mix. So we need 25 milliliter of water. Yes. We need one cup. This is one cup. We we'll need to add half. So this is around 50 ml spoon, of water. Half a spoon of butterfly pea powder. Okay. Let we add first 25 this is ml a spoon of. and we need to take half so, of the spoon and fill it up with this. I have taken 25 ml of water. We need, I half. guess, half of the spoon. And this is okay, I think. Okay, I think this is good. Yes. Yeah. Let me put it in this there cup. Go, there we go. That's perfect. So we have taken half teaspoon full of this. This is not teaspoon, this is very this small. This is very small. So we'll add into this. Put it in here. And now, and put now we will right we'll mix it with the help of a small stick. stick. So this, this is a stick is for mixing it. Mix, mix, mix. Mix it like that. So what is the color of this solution now? Now this is very bluish. Like very blue. So this butterfly pea powder we made, have mixed this and into it, water. And it made the water blue. Because of some pigment present in this pea powder. I think that is anthrocyanin something like that. And uh, we have mixed it. Now and we now, go to the next step. Let's see the next step. What is the next step? We need a small container and put it into something. Where is the small container? No, this is not the... Uh, we'll need one spoon of citric acid okay. now. Yeah. So... I we'll, just... I read the other one, so... So we'll that need... That is not good. We one spoon of citric, citric acid. acid. So this is citric acid okay. and we have taken this. Put it right there. We'll put it in there. I am pouring this put, it in put, this. Just throw it in there. Yes, perfect. Now I will mix it. Mix the stirring stick. Now mix it all up. Oh wow. Okay. You okay, can see the me, me, color me. change. You can see the color change. Whoa, that's Cool. So it is now turned into a violet color or purple color. Yes. I don't know. 
our experiment is successful did, did you see the solution in cup 1 turned purple so now, it did it actually yes, did nice it has turned into a purple color liquid now what is the science behind it there is a science behind it because acids they dissolve in water to release hydrogen ions so when this citric acid this can, this is some acid and it has dissolved in this water and there is a release of hydrogen ions now hydrogen ions they react with butterfly pea powder which was already in this solution and there is a color change to purple so what is the result any substance which turn this butterfly pea solution into purple color that is a acidic substance so this is our experiment number one this butterfly P it acts as an indicator solution so now we'll now, check that's now to the next experiment we will check now whether any substance need. is basic or not yes for this we need we need some butterfly pea powder which is this and baking soda so we have already butterfly pea powder we have baking soda with us so what is the first step we'll again yeah. take 25 Five milliliters of, of water, water. And yes we have taken this pour it like this now we add and one and half spoon of butterfly tea powder and i would like to do that too you hold that it is sufficient now i think it's good yes add a little more there we go perfect and now we mix it put it right there in there now we put it right there and mix it mix it all up and make it blue again it's gonna make it blue again right yeah it's turning blue so this indicator solution is now blue in color now what is the next step we will add one spoon of baking soda. I would do that please because I did not get the chance to add the citric acid. So now she is adding one spoon of baking soda. There we go. Now we'll mix it. Mix, mix, mix. Wow. Now there is a color change. And let me see. Is, let me see. Which color is this? It is know. green color. Yeah, it's green. Now it has turned into show green me, show colors. Me, show me, show me. Wow. So this butterfly pea solution, which was originally blue in color, it has changed to green color. So what is the result? The science behind this. Basis which is baking soda in this case when it dissolves in water it causes the release of hydroxide ions OH minus which is a minus charge OH minus charge these are hydroxide ions these ions when these react with butterfly pea powder or solution the color is changes to green yes so substances which turn the butterfly pea solution into green they are basic in nature so our experiment is successful and we have noted in this experiment that butterfly pea solution is an indicator solution and citric acid is acidic in nature it has turned this butterfly pea solution into a purple color and this baking soda is basic in nature it has turned this butterfly pea solution which was blue in color initially to into green color so you can see both of these yes so so the butterfly pea solution and turned the water blue and the the citric, citric acid turned the 
first experiment into purple and the baking and the baking soda turned it and turned the, it it to green so our experiment is successful we have learned about acidic and basic nature of some substances yes we did like citric acid which is present in fruits that is acidic in nature and baking soda that is basic in nature which is the part of some antacid tablets also so it is a basic in nature so our experiment is now complete if you like this video please like and share with your friends and subscribe and we both will see you guys in the next two experiments till then bye bye, bye, -bye.